What is research? What do you think of when you hear the word research? You might imagine a scientist working in a laboratory with test tubes. Or you might think of reading about a topic and writing a report. Or maybe you picture someone looking through a microscope. All research has one thing in common. It starts with a question. And then the researchers try to answer their question by doing experiments, or collecting data, or looking for new information. In medical research, the questions focus on finding better ways to take care of patients. Questions like, what is the cause of inflammatory bowel disease in children? Or, can our hospital do better at heart surgery? Or, how do kids manage asthma during the school day? It takes a lot of people to do medical research. Doctors, nurses, research staff, and people who are trained to look at the results and see what we can learn. But in medical research, the most important person is you. If you say yes to joining a research study, you are called a participant. Here at Lurie Children's Hospital, we like to say you are a very important participant. A VIP. If you want to take part in a research study, the study doctor, called an investigator, will tell you about the research. There are many different kinds of research studies that you could take part in. Some studies involve collecting information from your medical chart, where your health information is kept. Some require a small sample of blood for testing in a lab. Some ask you questions about how you feel and if your health condition changes the things you do every day, like going to school or playing with your friends. Other studies try to learn about new medicines or treatments to see which is best for each patient, or if one treatment is better than another. If you are thinking about becoming a VIP, there are four very important things that you and your family should know about. Your choice, your privacy, your protections, and your informed consent. First, taking part in a research study is your choice. If you are asked to be a participant, you and your family can say no. And if you do say yes at first, you can change your mind at any time and stop taking part in the study. If you don't want to take part in a research study, you will still receive your medical care that your doctor would prescribe. Second, taking part in a research study is private and confidential. Sometimes, this means that your name and identity will be hidden before the researchers can use your medical information during the study. And it means the researchers take many steps to keep your information safe and secure. Third, all research with patients is approved by an Institutional Review Board, or IRB for short. This board is a group of doctors, researchers, and community members that make sure that the rights and welfare of VIPs are protected when they participate in a study. And fourth, it is important that every VIP and their family fully understand the research study and what will happen if they choose to take part. When you are asked to be a participant, the study doctor or a research staff member will explain all the details of the study to you and your family. Before you and your family say yes or no to becoming a participant, you and your family should ask questions before you decide. This is called informed consent. You might ask questions like, What will happen in the research study? How long will I be in the study? What are you trying to learn from this research? You can also take your time and talk about the research study with others before you and your family decide. Now it's your turn, VIP. What questions do you have about research?